Hi, it's Marianne of MW's Designs. This is my second beta video vlog every day in April. I've been making some Easter decorations that I want to share with you. I started by making some little clip-on paper Easter eggs. They've got mini clothespins on the back. I bought the clothespins and the stick-on bow at the dollar store, so they're not very expensive to make. I used some watercolor paintings that I didn't like very much and cut the, the paper shapes out of the, that. And when they're egg-shaped, I thought they were quite cute. I've clipped them onto one of my Easter greeting cards and you can see a little bit closer view here. I put them on a tree branch that my husband painted for me. I've used blue and purple colors because I like those two colors together. And I'll give you a little bit closer view of some of them. I really like them a lot. I like how they turned out. I like the different colors in, in this one. I've used one as a bookmark, clipped it into my book. This is a really good book that I read fairly recently. It is by Liz Dean, just in case you want to check it out. I had a really pretty tulip bouquet that's just about finished now but I added some of my clip-on eggs to perk it up a bit. I clipped them onto wooden skewers and it does make it look a little bit nicer. I'll have it around for just a little bit longer. I made a mini Easter basket out of a cake liner, tissue paper and green ribbon. I'll give you a bit closer view here. I have one more idea that I want to try. I plan to make chocolate cupcakes and put this put the clip on eggs on toothpicks and then use them as cupcake toppers and I think that will be a really fun way to use them. Now if I can keep this from going blurry I'm going to show you the whole display. My next video is going to be an instruction video and hopefully I can get it done soon. These videos are harder to make than I thought they would be. So um, I'm still learning. If you like this video please give me a like or subscribe and Give me a comment down below. I'd like to hear from you. And until next time, thanks a lot.